As the executor of Mr. Muldoon's estate, I have been empowered to read Mr. Muldoon's last will and testament. Well, get on with it. The bar's open soon. <laughs> oh, poor dear Arthur. Ah! Oh, there, there, Jenny. God, how predictably boring. I never work for a kinder man. If we are all seated, I shall proceed with the reading. I knew it. <laughs> I, Arthur Durham Muldoon, being of sound mind and body... That's a laugh. <laughs> ...do hereby divide up my considerable estate as follows. To my overly emotional sister, Jenny... <laughs> Jenny, darling, he's talking about us. Oh. ...who grubbed with her husband, Hank, grubbed for everything they could get from me, and then cried crocodile tears when I needed sympathy. What? To Jenny, I leave a boot to the head. A what? Jenny, are you okay? And another boot to her wimpy husband, Hank. Ow! <laughs> this is an outrage. Ah, uh, but still, you are my sister. You have both admired my Rolls Royce, and since I no longer need it... Oh, dear Arthur, he's too kind. I bequeath another boot to the head. What? Ow! <laughs> and one more for the wimp. Ow! Next to my alcoholic brother... Hey, I don't want no boot to the head. <laughs> To dear Hedge, who has never worked a day in his drunken life... I'm covering up my head. I leave my wine cellar and three crates of my finest whiskey. Really? And a boot to the head. Oh! And another for Jenny in the wind. Oh! Oh! Next, to my know-it-all nephew, Ralston... This is so predictable. I leave a boot to the head. Oh, I knew it. And one for Jenny in the wind. This takes care of family obligations. And now to Mrs. Mulroy. Oh, I don't want nothing. <laughs> who took care of me faithfully these many, many years. Who cared, made me laugh, brought me tea. Oh, I didn't mind. To Mrs. Mulroy, I bequeath a boot to the head. <laughs> and one for Jenny in the wind. Ah! Oh! And so to my cat mittens, I leave my entire vast boot to the head. And finally, to my lawyer, who has helped me on this will, I leave not a boot to the head, but a rabid Tasmanian devil to be placed in his trousers. Oh, 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 and, and, and I leave my entire estate of $10 million to the people of Calgary so they can afford to move somewhere decent. <laughs> That's it? That's disgraceful. Yeah, There's one last thing for everyone. Cover your heads, everybody. <laughs> I leave everyone a lifetime supply of ice cream. Ice cream? Ice cream. Ice cream. That's all? That's all. Well, what flavor is it? Boot to the head. Oh! Oh! 